Hello guys, my name is Matthew and in today's video I'm going to show you how you can work in Bamboo HR to make your workspace as comfortable as you can. Straight away uh, we need to create ourselves an account, uh, preferably this free trial that you can, uh, that you can try and uh, find out if the Bamboo HR is a really the application for you. Once we're here Straight away, we are in our taskbar. So we can go from the left to the bottom. As you can see, that's my name. You can view your informations. You can go and explore them. For example, those are personal. We have five employees, uh, active. Oh, sorry, we are emp uh, employee number five. Uh, status is active. Uh, that's my uh, name, date of birth, just completely wrong. Gender. Marital, uh, marital status and so on you can tweak them around uh, how you like it you can go to the job in this free trial i'm uh, working full-time uh, and job information linden utah north america and operations you can always edit it you can update uh, the information and so on and so on uh, my direct reports, ethnicity, and so on, time off. If you basically need to let your uh, employer know how much time or when you want to take a holiday, or when you want to go to holiday, you can do that in uh, Bamboo HR. As you can see, I have 36.3 days of uh, of uh, holiday, 40 days of sick leave, and so on and so on. There are some COVID-19 absence. So we can go and uh, record time off from, for example, tomorrow till 23rd. Uh, as you can see, it's automatically counting down uh, the hours presuming that Saturday and Sunday are days off. Family meeting, for example, you can click save. And straight away you see from August 20 to 23, you get 18 hours off from holiday. We have some emergency, emergency contact. Let's go like that. Uh, that uh, when you won't be available or something happen in your uh, in your office for example you get injured or something uh, the next person will be contacted those are some documents notes benefits as you can see there are some private medical insurances, dental, life insurance, disabilities, and uh, the people that uh, are uh, dependent on me, training, assets, and more. But let's go back. On the left side, when we are sticking uh, to this one, we have our, as you can see, uh, we have our holidays and sick leaves. Uh, we have uh, the guys or the employees who are uh, who's out on vacation or doctor appointments. Uh, some of them will be tomorrow, Saturday, Sunday. And as you can see, as I set up my holidays, you will see that at uh, Monday I'm out as well. Then you have some events like celebrations. Uh, company website, uh, there are benefits, health and vision, COVID-19 rules, and so on, so on, so on, and so on. As you can see, our headcount report uh, is reporting 85 employees. There are some charts. Uh, there are some charts that uh, are monitoring the employee level. My informations. You can really you can really tweak it around. So anytime you want to uh, monitor someone or you want to 
uh, come up with uh, some holidays, you can just easily use Bamboo HR. Reports, also hiring. Let's go and we can go, for example, with job opening, position title, let's go with janitor. Open hiring lead, yeah, it doesn't matter. Department, let's go human resources to get rid of them. Full time, entry level, country, location, for example, doesn't matter. Compensation, let's go with 20 because we are. We are uh, really generous. Save job opening. Oh, yeah. What have I? Oh, job description. Just clean. Save job opening. And as you can see, we have uh, one uh, job open as a janitor. So straight away, right here, and candidates. You can check the candidates by uh, their uh, CV. Then you can uh, decide if you want to hire them or not. Also, we can go to people. And as you can see, there are all the employees. So let's say you want to, uh, you want to monitor all your or employees uh, through Bamboo. And there's basically a very easy way to do it. Let's go with new employee. We have to give him a number. We have 85, so it will be number 86. Oh, seven. Okay, 888. First name, John, whatever. You can go with like this and all the information then you will you can give him uh, access to bamboo or no access but yeah let's allow him to yeah nope save and as you can see upcoming trainings this is a very very nice way to uh, to track your employees we can also go to account settings or epic keys to check them out in the top right corner epic key if you want to make if you want to make integration between bamboo hr and uh, for example salesforce you can always do it uh, through through integration apps like zapier or automate and if you want to do it through Zapier, for example, you will need the API key. Like you can generate it and add it. Once you do that uh, and you want to make this integration, you want you need to log into your Bamboo HR at Zapier, and then Zapier will ask you for your API verification, which is very safe way to not get your account hacked because let's presume that only you have access to this one then we have inbox onboarding people time of requests we can approve it or we can deny it and what else we have here asset request signatures company handbook review and sign as you, as, I, uh, as you can see, you can even sign documents in here, like this, and confirm signature. Now you've signed this document. As you can, as you can see, this Bamboo HR is providing you really, really wide palette of options. So. I hope you guys uh, find it tutorial helpful and maybe you even decided to you maybe even decided to go with Bamboo HR as your default 
HR option. So thanks for watching and see you on the next video.